most favorite makeup items of 2014. So let's get started. So the first thing has to do with the eyes. Now I have been using the Milani Brow Fix Brow Kit right here for my eyebrows. I've really been trying to learn how to do my eyebrows this year. Well, last year, this past year. So um, I usually use this one right here, the in dark, it's in the number three. And I'm still learning how to use this. I've been looking on, look going on YouTube, trying to find different ways of using this. But you know, I'm trying, you guys. So you know, don't hold that against me. But I also um, been loving the um, Wet and Wild eyeshadows. I've been loving their palette, especially this one in the color Vanity. I love a new look. I really do love neutral looks. So this has been one of my most go-to eyeshadow palettes for 2014 so I need to pick up another one because I'm almost out on these two these two colors the last two so yeah this is the vanity palette by Wet n Wild so this has been one of my most favorite palettes to use but I also um use the elf palette as well and here's their palette this is their neutral palette their 144 palette so I have been dibbling and dabbling all up and through this palette. As you can see, I'm missing some around here because I drop it all the time. But yeah, this is one of my favorite palettes to use as well. So that's one of my most um, used palettes besides um, the Wet n Wild Vanity Palette. And also I have another Wet n Wild palette that came out last year and it's called Smoke and Melrose, which I use today to get this look on my face or well, this look. So yeah, I like it. Um, some of the colors I really don't like because it's not it's not as it's not as much pigmentation as I would like. But you know, for two ninety nine or three ninety nine, you can't beat that. You just have to work with what you got. So yeah, I have been liking this palette right here. Let's see if you can see this right here. And also, I have been loving the CoverGirl Queen palette. I like this one caught my eye because of the blue tones to it. So yeah, this um, one right here caught my eye. So I have been loving that color right there. And so next, let's go to the lips. So I'm all about the lips. I have, I counted my lipsticks yesterday and I'm almost to 60 lipsticks. And I know that is a lot for a girl to have, especially for me, especially for a girl who used to wear only clear lip glosses and coming out and wearing lipsticks has been a big step up for me so i wanted to start off by my go-to lipstick and it is santagria by milani and it's the number 21 let's see if you can see it yeah number 21 and here it is right here you guys it is a beautiful beautiful shade and um, I love this shade and also teddy bear number 29 and it is a beautiful nude shade so this is a great shade for you guys to wear as well especially for women of color who wants to wear a nude lip I suggest you guys to wear this one and chocolate berries this is a beautiful one it's like a burgundy undertone but also it has um, a brown undertone as well so I love chocolate berries and if you see me keep looking this way it's because my mirror is here and I'm trying to see if I'm staying focused in the camera and all guys and also um, here is Leia's nude and this one is a beautiful color. I had this in my purse for like weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks. And I love this right here. So this is Leia's Nude right here, guys. And for blushes, I would have to say Black Radiance, hands down, is something that I have been wearing over and over. And this one is in Toasted Almond. And it is a beautiful color, guys. So, yeah, Toasted Almond is one of my favorites. And um, Warm Berry. And I usually wear a toasted almond on warm berry as an eyeshadow as well. Just because I think it's a beautiful color. And also, um, one of my most 
used the most favorite foundations or powders has to be the Amon Cosmetics um, Oil Blunt Powder. This is the only powder that I have, but in my one of my videos, I was showing you how I would use the um, NYX eyeshadow palettes. I used the Black Radiance Liquid Foundation in the color brownie. Um, I trashed that one because it was not working for me. It made me very oily and very greasy. So um, I bought the CoverGirl 3 in 1 liquid foundation in the color soft copper and it has been doing me justice I'm wearing it today and you can't even tell that I look any kind of oily at all I have loving this right here so um, that is all for my favorite makeup items of 2014 I do not have a lot because I try to keep my makeup very simple what I really do splurge on a lot is a lipstick so I don't really splurge a lot on makeup I mean eyeshadow palettes. I have a couple which I will do a haul for you guys very soon. So yeah, um, this is what I have bought. So I just want to thank you guys for watching and subscribing to my channel. I have been seeing a lot of you comment on my videos and it makes me feel very good that you want to hear feedback from me. And I hope I see you in the next one guys.